What's up, everybody? I am BK, bkbangers.com. Welcome to another video. Today's video, I want to showcase to you guys how to use Sample Tank 3 inside of, I'm going to show you guys how to use it in an MPC, uh, but you can use it in any DAW of your choice. I'm just showing you guys how to use it in an MPC 2.1 software with the MPC live setup so sample tank 3 is a uh, is something similar to like omnisphere or complete uh contact complete a bunch of different sound modules uh they just released this syntronic syntronic is somewhat again it's like artoria it has a lot of those sick synths inside of it I used to use Sample Tank 2 and Sample Tank 2 Excel for the upgrade to Sample Tank 3. I was grandfathered into Sample Tank 3, which is a free version of it because I had those, the Sample Tank 2. I stopped using Sample Tank 2 is because I moved up to 64-bit DAW usage and all of the old Sample Tank stuff is in 32-bit so i wasn't able to use it without using uh 32 lives i did a video on the on the channel uh about using 32 lives so if you're interested in that you can backtrack in the channel and just search on my channel 32 lives or something like that 32 lives but nonetheless sample tank 3 is out you know mg the future threw up the the moon signal you know the bat signal the moon signal wolfgang salute to all the wolfgang members out there um yeah he threw up the signal and i'm like yo i got sample tank 3 but i can't use it because it's in uh 32 bit i mean it's in 64 it's in 60 32 bit <laughs> I can't use it because it's in 32-bit mode. He's like, nah, it's 64-bit. I said, yeah, I tried using the 64-bit version, but the instruments don't play inside of it. He said, you can import it. I said, I tried doing this before. He responded like, you can, you can import it. I said, say no more. So I looked into it. It took a little bit of doing. I had to go back and forth with IK Multimedia Reps to get it to work for me. Now you might not have this issue, but I had this issue. So I'm gonna flip over into the MPC and show you guys how to set it up inside of your DAW. All right, catch you on the flip. We're over here in the MPC. This is Sample Tank 3, and I am using the Sample Tank free version. I'm going to show you guys how to set it up over here to the cog wheel it's up the setting panel. It's uh, the disk path for me is an external hard drive. You can choose whatever drive you use. The reason why I use an external drive is to, to, uh, to have less usage on the internal drive. I have a terabyte, but it's filled up with a lot of sounds and stuff like that. So it's almost maxed out. But anyway, you would click browse, you would highlight whatever hard drive you, you want to send it to. In this instance is my G drive, opened up a new folder and I titled it ST3 free, short for sample tank three, free. I then hit open and it, this is the current disk path, that simple, right? Now, where I messed up at originally was that like 2014, this is how long I had this software and I wasn't able to use it. I, uh, when I opened it, it only had this grand piano alone and it was cool, but you know, I was into Omnisphere and Nexus and Contact and I had a plethora of sounds. So you know, I didn't really need it per se, but there were sounds inside of 
the original Total Studio that I loved. You know, um, not on some romanticizing tip, but you know, it was reminiscent of the sounds that uh, I, I'm used to in hip hop. So, long story short, this panel was blank. So when MG said you could import the sounds, I did some digging and lo and behold, when you come over here to this little three lines, it looked like kind of like a hamburger a little bit. It says <clears throat> import legacy instruments. So you click import legacy instruments, you name whatever this folder is that you're going to import from. You click browse, you whatever you title it you highlight it you click open and once you click open you click import now this may take a long time or it may take a short amount of time for me it took a long time because every time i imported the sounds this panel would it still was blank so i was having some difficulties so i uninstalled sample tank 3 then i reinstalled sample tank 3 and it automatically mapped it and brought up this area right here. Also, you can do that with Singtronic Free, the free version. You could do the same thing. You go here, import legacy instrument, you look for Singtronic in, on your hard drive, and then you map it. Now, Singtronic only works with Sample Tank, although it's a standalone uh, software. All right, now, you can use Sample Tank 3 as a standalone uh, virtual instrument. But you know, we got DAWs, that's what DAWs for. So that's what I'm gonna showcase to you guys today. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and stop this recording because I gotta make sure that this is recording. This is my fourth time trying this. All right, so catch out on the flip. So this is this, the first sound that I, uh, I, I use the grand piano. a nice sound of grand piano but you know we want the we want those things right so the next track was when we go to sequence two inside of here the sound from Syntronic this is how it sounds by itself All right, so we got that going. The next track uh, that I use, I use another instance of Sample Tank 3. Um, this was a ring modulation sound that I used. And... I use it as an ARP. I can't play that, play it back for you the way that I played it because I did it live. And again, this is the third time I'm recording this. So I don't remember exactly what I did to get it. But I basically put note repeat on in the MPC and I played the keys in an art kind of fashion, if that makes any kind of sense. All right, so I'm gonna play it back. I'm gonna solo the track and play it for you so you hear it. All right, so 
the next track that I used Sample Tank 3 on was this J8 Submarine. Um, it's like a, we all know what this, this, uh, this is right here. If you don't know, it's the, um, the J8, the Jupiter 8, or is it Juno? The Juno 6 and Jupiter 8. But you know what I'm talking about. It's one of those, uh, classic analog keyboards. I'm again solo it so you can hear what I did with it. Sounds so beautiful, man. So the next track that I use, I use the uh This was the uh, bass sound out of uh, the Andromi bass. It's out of Sample Tank 2 synths. We don't get that beautiful uh, <laughs> image of a synth machine. I guess they didn't update the, um, the imagery as yet. But that's the bass sound, so I'm gonna solo it. All right, so that's that's that, and then I think that was it. So. I'm going to play it back for you so you hear it all together. Sounds beautiful. So the next thing I did in the prior recording that's scrambled, um, I went ahead and I added some drums. The drums come from um, from MG the Future, Low Castle. So I'm not gonna, you know, play the drums. <laughs> Because I already did it, so so I'm not going to play the drums because I've already done them. So I'm going to just solo the track real quick so you can hear the pattern, the drum pattern. All right, so those, you know, not no crazy drums, but all together sounds like this. Yeah, man, that's Sample Tank 3. 
and how I would use it. I'd love to hear how you use it. If uh, you already up on Sample Tank 3, salute to you. Um, if you're not, <laughs> get with it. Go over to IK Multimedia um, and look for it, man. This is not a, a, a sponsored video. I don't get paid for these videos, but I like to share with you guys because when I started out in the production world and I was searching for certain, for certain information, the information wasn't there. I mean, there's lots of information now, but um, as far as for what I was looking for, you know, the information wasn't there. So I try to share with you guys whenever I come across anything new or something old. In this case, Sample, Sample Tank 3 is old because, again, I had it since 2014, but I wasn't able to utilize it. But now that I'm able to utilize it, I will, I'm going to do a lot more um, videos showing the utilization of Sample Tank 3. Salute to MG the Future. Um, he said, all you got to do is import it. And he, he just left it like that. Like, you can import it. I'm like, what? I tried. You can import it. So salute to the homie. Um, do remember that music is life. It is our DNA, y'all. Keep banging. Peace, love, and light. Till next time. I'm going to go ahead and, you know, close out with just playing some of this back to back to back to back to back. Thanks.